Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Fallout 4. Hope you guys are having an amazing day. And uh, I hope you guys are excited as much as I am to uh, get into this episode. Hopefully you're not hearing my rooster in the background, but my rooster is kind of outside, <laughs> just crowing away. Um, so last episode was brutal. We went to the... Uh, let's look at the map here. The U.S. AF Satellite Station Olivia. Uh, we got our butt kicked a bunch of times. But I think we're going to do a, a few things. Uh, hopefully do a few things here. More than just the settlement stuff. Um, we got to get some more stuff for uh, Jake before we can do any further. We have to go down here and fight those super mutants at the West Everett Estate. And that's going to take me a little bit of time. So why, why don't we actually head on down towards Concord and go into Fallon. So Fallon's was where we talked to that little girl and she's looking for Murphy, her little friend Murphy. But I'd also like to go to the uh, Thicket Excavation. Uh, if you remember correctly, there's some... Um, I can't remember what they're called now. They're the... I can't remember what they're called, but uh, we're going to... I think we're going to go there first. Uh, we are sick. Uh, we do have weakness on us, so it's going to be a little interesting to see how this goes. We do need to find some way of, of getting out of there. Uh, out of that. I think uh, if we can sleep a little... Uh, let's actually take a look and see what we have here. Uh, I'm kind of curious if we have any... Do we have any water? Can we search? Water. We do. Oh, 24 purified water. Okay, we're just going to keep the five on us. Uh, we'll drink before we leave, but it looks like we're getting a bunch of water. There we go. Uh, so let's go ahead and sleep. What oh, is currently day, isn't it? Uh, I guess we're not going to sleep. I think we're just going to get going. Uh, let's talk to Preston. Uh, this is going to continue with the Minutemen quest line, and we'll kind of do that in conjunction of everything else. So let's. Excuse me. Preston. Hey, good to see you again. I was hoping you'd show up. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. No, Preston, you're what welcome. You you're welcome to stay here because this is my place, not yours. <laughs> it wasn't your idea. You're just welcome to stay. Yeah, I used to like living here before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying? Yeah, yeah, Preston. I've been here way longer than you, bud. I lived here over 200 years ago. I, I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? You know, that's actually a good, uh, good question. I don't think anybody did besides... Just besides say. Sean. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. Have you run across anybody with a baby boy? Damn, I'm sorry. But no, I haven't run across any kidnapped babies. I'll definitely keep an eye out for him. Anyway, I am glad you're here. Oh, and I hope hey. you don't mind. <laughs> but I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. That was an awkward pause. They're still hoping there are Minutemen out there somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out the settlement? What do you mean you have handfuls? You're just walking around with your gun. What kind of help do they need? Sounded like the usual. He's just Raiders. being lazy. You'll have to get all the details when you talk to them. I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. The men and men could use more people like you. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. All right, we can talk to Sturgis. Uh, Sturgis? Out here, you Grab gotta Ross. things one day at a time. Uh, usually, Sturgis is kind of around this building here. Here he is. Hey, Sturgis. You willing to do some work? What kind of help do you need? Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. Uh, I, I, do you not like the beds that I built you already? 
Why do you need my help to build beds? Look, we got a lot on our plate, and we've been on the run for weeks. We need food, water, shelter, you name it. Well, you asked how you could help. I told you. Did you mean it or not? <laughs> wow, Sturgis. Easy. Calm down, bud. I'd be glad to help. Okay. Good deal. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over our heads. Some of these old houses still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need anything. Yeah, we're kind of ahead of you. 100%. Talk to Sturgis. Sturgis. I like it. Having a place to sleep will improve everyone's spirits. What we need now is a reliable source of clean water. Uh, new house design. That's actually kind of cool. Once you shut the door, you cannot hear their... Whoa. <laughs> is that because I talked to Sturgis? I'm on it. Clean water coming up. Great. Thanks again. All right. Sturgis. I'm done with that too. Already, knowing we have a reliable supply of clean water. I hope you don't mind me asking now for some food. More help, but our food supplies are running low. If we're gonna settle here, we'll need to get some crops established. Already ahead of you, bud. What kind of crops are you looking for? Well, it doesn't much matter. Potatoes, mute fruit, corn, whatever you can get to grow. And I'll go do it. Oh, I'm done. <laughs> hey, Sturgis. Well, this place is starting to feel like. I wish home. it would have like auto. Now that we can grow our own food, like you would bypass really these checks. This. Trouble is, the more we establish ourselves here, the more of a target we become. What we need is to get some defenses set up. Then maybe Preston will be able to relax a little bit. What sort of defenses did you have in mind? Walls, sandbags, turrets, whatever you can put together. Actually, my defenses are not very good, so we should probably do a little bit better job with it. Sturgis. But thanks for doing that. Well, also this will work for now. Knowing we have some defenses set up, it's been a long road. But yeah, I think this is it. Oh, feels good. What next? Well, I guess figuring out how to get back to living instead of just surviving. Did dog meat just sneeze? Of course, you know you're welcome anytime. My door's always open to you. Windows too. Some of the walls actually come to think of it. I guess I better get back to it. Take care now. Sweet. We leveled up. Let's go ahead and just throw a save down. Level 10. Okay, so we got to level up. Uh, what are we going to put that in. We can do riflemen. We don't have a... Well, we do have a rifle, right? We do have the hunting rifle. Could do lock picking. Go into expert. Uh, we don't have any hacking yet. Hmm. Uh, is there going to be anything else that would probably be better? What about action girl? There's no time to waste. Your action points regenerate 25% faster. That might not be a bad idea because I'm probably going to be using a... L <laughs> um... My vats, quite a bit, and having action points would be really nice. Uh, is there anything maybe that we can go into that we don't have out yet? Uh, blacksmith would probably be decent. Strong back, carrying capacity, that might not be bad at some point in time as well. Um, I, I don't know exactly what we're ultimately going to be getting into. I, I really actually kind of think about this concentrated fire would be kind of <laughs> would be nice. Penetrator would be nice. Sniper. I, I kind of like that type of build. Why don't we lock picking is so good. I don't do very much pickpocketing. So why don't we do this? Right now, I think, since we don't have very much in perception, hmm, this actually might not be a bad idea either. Hmm. 
You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna grab hacker. Um, hacking and lock or uh, locksmithing or picking picking locks, you know, are gonna be pretty important. Pressing mechanic sh uh, shack. That's kind of interesting. I'm guessing that's gonna unlock after some time. Oh yeah, we gotta move those other beds inside. We're not gonna do that today though. We're gonna go out and do some exploring. Let's do it. Got our trusty gun here. We only have four shots of or uh, eight Hope here. Lights up soon. Yeah, me too. <laughs> this sucks. Okay, we're hurting on ammo. We really, really, really badly need ammo. Serious note. Calling all patriots. Explore the derelict office building. Where is that? Oh, whoop, 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 whoop. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, it's right next to the Everett, West Everett estate. Okay, let's go to Thicket first. I just gotta remember, I gotta be able to, I, I need to remember to save more frequently. <laughs> Nuka Cola. Look at that, that's a Nuka gun. Is that actually a real thing? That'd be actually kind of cool. Really need to, you know, we should really go through town here and see if there isn't any more ammo. There's some cram. Oh, hello. That's actually a good sign. Oh, you know what we should have got nice. the perk for? Yeah, there we go. I'll leave the pistol. Uh, we should have really actually... Oh, here we go. We should have went to... Let's see here. Fortune Finder. Scrounger. I should have put one more into luck. So we would have found more ammo. That was probably a bad move on, move on my hey. part. No, I want the insta. The mash, purify water. If we can find any way of curing ourselves, that would be immensely. These are just for resist. Need cure. Maybe one of these houses have something. Kickball. That's not a thing. Most of these houses are boarded up tight. Can't get into them. All right. Let's keep going here. We'll come back and explore this a little bit in a little uh, in a little bit of time here. Ew. Holy sunset sarsaparilla! Twenty of them in silver rush. That is a ton of them. Do we have enough weight? We do. So that we're gonna have to drop some of those off, of course. Back at our base. Oh, there's some houses up here, too. Okay, so here's the excavation site. And generally, this is kind of like gets bugged out. The water does. So there's supposed to be water that covers it. Unless a mod kind of gets rid of it. Doesn't look like there's any water in there now. Oh, there's some. I thought it was filled up further. 
I could be wrong. I, it's been a long time since I played this, so... I could be mistaken. And I think there's someone here. Let me help out. Ooh, hello. Taboo tattoos. Nice. Unlock uh, unique facial tattoos. Hey, can you guys let me know if the audio sounds okay? Like, is is the music good? Is the... Like, for me, it seems like it's okay. But I just want to make sure that everybody's able to hear it good. Also, um... How's the, the visual? Make sure that it's... Is it bright enough? Hi. Let me know down in the... Looking to earn some caps? Let me know down in the description I below. I use a hand here if you're all done talking, you know. I could probably help for a few caps extra. I could probably help for a few caps extra. I was going to give you something anyway. 75 caps for your time. Ooh. Not sure if I'm up to it. A couple more caps might change my mind. Not sure if I'm up for it. Couple Let's get as much as we can. Caps might change my mind, though. Just had to push oh, it. 50 bucket. caps. Take it or leave it. Yeah, I guess it. I guess. What do you need help with? I tried. The pump isn't in top shape, but... It should at least start. There must be some leaky connections flooding me out. Think you could fix them? The leaks will be underwater. Look for bubbles, and you should find them. Okay. Which actually sucks right now because we are in for some pain. All right. There are bubbles right there. Right there. And I think there's one over here. Uh, jet. Adhesive is going to be something that we're going to 100% use. And there's bubbles there. There's just three of them. Oh, God. Seriously? Lack of food? Uh, we just picked up some food, so why don't we eat something? Mutton chops? There we go. All right, let's do this. Uh, uh, oh, here we go. Wow. Rad city here. I should have took something for that. Ooh, that's a lot of rads. Okay, we talk to Sully here. Come on. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm out. I'm out. Ooh. I'm actually going to take something for this. Is there something in here? I don't think I checked this out. Did I? No. We're going to be in for a fight. So I'm going to get ready and prepared for it. Because I already know what's going to happen, kind of. Uh, chem, cap stash, dirty water, which I don't really want to take right now. We'll take the stem pack. Please be some ammo. Oh. Broke it. Yes. Ooh, another hunting rifle. Ooh, 308s. Okay. That's going to help. That is going to help for sure. Thicket excavation terminal. Hop on the computer and see what's going on here. Shipment log. Tables and tops. They're just places that we were delivering. Play tape. Sully's journal. Dick 17. This is a great spot with the right crew. I'd have no problem keeping this place locked down. Traders run close enough for easy pickings, but not so close that we end up um, end up skinned. The whole damn thing filled with water, though, figures. There's always a catch. 
big ass drainage pipe uh, looks almost intact if I'm lucky it might still work we can take a look closer look tomorrow here's the next day nope uh, not gonna be that easy still the pump is in better shape than you'd think I'd like to head back and grab some tools but it's pretty late I'm, I'll tinker with it uh, some tomorrow uh, some Sorry, before I bed down tomorrow, then head out in the morning. And then two days later, shouldn't be too hard. Now, glad I grabbed that sledge, even if it was a bitch to carry all this way. Things, uh, thing was rusty, uh, rusted tight. If you could wax with the sledge, cleared that problem right up. Thing made the damnedest sound each time, though. You'd swear something was moving around in there. Oh, only if you knew. Uh, the 22nd was able to make some uh, of the connections patched up all the pipes leaks I can find besides the ones in the water. All the noise I've been hearing, I'm not setting foot in there. Probably head back and drag one of the new guys over here and make him do it. Now uh, we kind of want to be careful heading in here. Let's uh, eject the hollow tape. We'll just steal his journal because we're we're just that type of people, you know? <laughs> I just hope there's some meds in here. I mean, it's a chem box, so probably not. Got it. No, just mentats and whatnot. Okay, we're going to set up my alerts, my alerts. That's what they are. My alerts. They're, uh, they're going to be popping out of the water here. Uh, I think what we're going to do is we're going to do a little preemptive striking here. I never use these, so that's why I'm going to do them now. Um, nope, don't do that. We're going to throw one there. Uh, why is that not... I've never seen it land on its side. Don't run over that dog meat, I don't think. Okay. Uh, why don't we... Uh, do we have a rat away? We do. Adds fatigue and suppresses immunity. Hmm. We should have done the rat resist. Okay. Uh, let's eat some food. Crispy squirrel bites. Vegetable soup. 22 rad resist. Ooh, that would have been a good one. Mutt chops. Okay, properly fed. Uh, we should probably drink as well. Okay. We'll just wait for our rads to go down before and heal up before we start this. Because otherwise, it can get pretty bad. Uh, let's see here. We've got... Oh, man. We don't have very many shots. What do I have if everything runs out? Do I have anything that would help me? We do have the pistol. So we could fall back on the pistol if we need to. And that's got a, quite a bit of rounds. Okay. That, that makes me a little bit more... Uh, okay, uh, switch to explosives. Let's go to the Molotovs. Okay, uh, let's, let's do it. Here we go. Oh boy, uh, that did not work out very good. What just happened? Oh god. Ouch. Oh, <laughs> we just got smoked. Oh no, I don't know if he can hit us or not. We're dead. <laughs> I, maybe I should have stayed up there. I was probably safe. I knew this was going to be bad. Mylarks, they have the tough shell and you can't really hit them very easily. You have to hit them like, like you have to get in front of them. All right, let's try, let's try a different approach. Uh, I didn't know they're going to spawn up here. That's what sucks. Uh, 
Can I jump on the machine, maybe? There we go. If I can get them in... No, 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 no. That's not actually not what I wanted to do. If I can get them in the legs... Oh, we got all the legendary on top of this. They don't like, uh, okay, he... I wish I could turn the other one. Okay, dog meat. You're doing great, dog meat. Just don't get up here. Okay. And you can't really shoot him in the shell because the shell really doesn't do anything at all. Sully's still alive. Keep going, Sully. Come on, shoot him. You have unlimited ammo, but... Okay, are we good? All right, let's get dog meat up. Dog meat. There we go. Ooh, what are we gonna get? Reduce damage from ghouls by fifteen percent. Actually, that's not gonna be bad. Do we have more? I don't remember. Hey, Meyer looks. I guess I shouldn't be surprised that started him off. Anyway, I still got some tinkering to do on this thing. Shouldn't be too hard now, though. Thanks for pitching in. Here's a little something before you clean it out. Okay, is it not going to drain? I thought it drained. Hmm. I swear it drained down. Okay, maybe, maybe we got to come back. Maybe we got to come back. All right. Does anybody know if that's the case? Oh, you know what? Dogmi, do you still have a bunch of stuff on you? No, I cleaned them up. Okay. I couldn't remember if we cleaned them up or not. Uh, why don't we put on that piece of armor if it's going to be better? It's not really. It's not really. I mean, the ghoul part is going to help out, especially if we're going to go be into town. And we're going to run into some ghouls, so we'll, I guess we'll grab it. Oh, so you guys can see how difficult this is going to be. This is going to be just... Just really insanely difficult. It's going to be fun, though. Please, nope, ran right away. Not what I needed. Oh, dude. There's a dude here. Oh, you killed some rad scorpions? That's what these are. Nuclear stinger. Dude. Whoa. And you killed raiders? Oh, buddy, this... I don't want to mess with this dude. Alright, let's take a look and see what we have. I, I, I have to put on anything that's better than what I have. So that's the only way we're going to survive. I think we're going to talk to this dude. Hi. Need Billy to get Ross? back to Diamond City one of these days. Biggest town I ever saw. Bill Ross. All right. Uh, there's another. Ooh, wait, what? Pickup truck. Un... Is looting vehicles new or is this a mod? I wonder if this is a mod. Yes. I don't remember this in the base game.
blood pack. We're not going to get into drinking too much. Can we get into this shipping container? Nope. Why is it glowing green? <laughs> is there... Oh, I have my light on. That's why. That makes a lot more sense. Well, this one I can unlock too. Sweet. You could call the bottle. Hubcap. Mmm. What does this give me? Screws and aluminum? Sure. Yeah, that's kind of new to me. I, I've never seen that before. Where you can loot vehicles. I like it. Let's switch over to the other gun. Alright, we have a house here we can check out. Oh, there's a raider in here too. And I just need some meds. Bobby pins, some pork and beans. Gotta love those pork and beans. Place to sleep. I just gotta remember, if we get tired, pop a Nuka Cola. Pop a Nuka Cola and we will be grand for a little bit. I don't know if there's any negatives or uh, can we loot these? These are meters, right? No. Jake? Jake is still probably lugging that stuff back. All right, let's go find the Fallon house. I think that was uh, to help that little girl. And uh, a few of you have mentioned about how how odd she sounds. And it's she's actually from a, a DLC. So, or not a DLC. This is actually a, a mod. And I'm guessing that one of the developers probably put their daughter in for the voice acting. So Fallon's administrative building. That'd be so cool to be able to ride a motorcycle. Okay, let's go see what's out, uh, going on in here. So we got to find Murphy. I'm guessing uh, it's one of her friends. I don't know why she's out in, Con out in Concord by herself, especially with all the bandits around. Like, who in the wor right world, world right, would let her out there by herself? Holy armored. Whoa. Balanced apartment store. These aren't active, are they? Okay, I think we got some raiders going on here. Alan's report. All right, we're gonna look around first before we go on the terminal. Can't grab that. Expert, unlock that. Looks like an automatic pipe. No, that's not a pipe pistol, is it? That is not a pipe pistol. Holy dog meat! Oh, I hear red roach. Oh, this is a whole setup. Whoa. Very, oh, hello. Flares. Please, meds. I just need one med. Oh, no. Wait, does Excel... What does Excel give us? Oh, it's a amazing. Excel gives us everything for two minutes. 
Oh, we got some fusion cells, more 10 mil, some duct tape, fusion core. I'm actually thinking we should have brought our power armor now. <laughs> uh, ooh, we got a safe. Got it. So far, so good. Not digging that we're finding a lot of those two power armors. Nuka Cola, Stem Pack, Bobby Pins. Okay. Ooh. Don't touch. <laughs> I touched it. Let's go try this door. Okay, you gotta be careful with doors. Okay, that seems... Wait, is that another door? No. That's just the wall, okay. There is nothing, nothing in here. Wires terminal. Okay, we gotta we gotta unlock it with the terminal. Uh, I have a feeling that if we screw this up, that we might be dead. Because I think all the guns will probably come alive. Or maybe we could turn it on and take care of everybody else that's upstairs or in the other rooms. Uh, shop living prevention. All team members, we have noticed a higher than average incident rate of shoplifting over the past two quarters especially when it comes to small jewelry items and dresses. Sales associates are not advised to directly confront customers. Security is employed for a reason, and our protectons should be more than up to the task once properly notified. The unfortunate death of the last two shoplifters were the cause due, or the course due to factory error, and no one should be guilty about it uh, even for a second. We did what we could on our hands, and our hands are clean. Headquarters statement on the matter should suffice if media requires, uh, media inquires persist. Robert Finch, Chief Operating Officer. Angloco, February Blood Drive. Hi everyone, after success of last year's epic blood drive, Con Glum. Co. I said that wrong last time, or the first time I said it. Uh, we'll once again be holding a blood drive on February 22nd from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. According to Con Glum Co. Chief of Blood Operations, Barry Trickle, every two seconds someone in the United States needs blood. It is absolutely essential for most surge, uh, surgeries, some cancer treatments, semi-chronic illnesses, and truly traumatic injuries. Whether a patient receives whole blood, red cell, platelets, or plasma, the gift of life-saving care starts with one person making a truly selfless, generous donation. And one donation can potentially save up to 17 lives. The attached document provides additional details and warning about potential dangers involved in giving blood in the modern age. Please let me know if you have any questions. This is honestly my favorite part of the job. And as we know, all know, I have ample, amply pr proven time and time again, I can discuss blood all day. Thanks, Joanne. August Vanille Hall MTD sales. Weekly sales down 3% to last year. Merchants uh, meeting focused on shoplifting crisis. Discussed Fallon's proposal for protectorons and uh, society objectives objections to it society issued veto on history oh historic prevention grounds so the concord people of concord were actually saying <laughs> they didn't want it all merchants agreed to detailed inventory track uh, tracking to assess the scope of the problem weekly sales so after i'm guessing the protectrons are in this is eight two so this is like falling week 
815. Week sales are up 15 due to Columbus Day holiday. Uh, Merchants inventory report shows net losses from the week with 12 confirmed shoplifting incidents. Oh, they don't have it up yet. Several merchants threatened to sue for breach of contract over security issues. Recommended moving forward with Protectron insta uh, installation despite society objections. Uh, and then the next week, weekly sales down 81% due to press coverage of the incidents. Seven deaths reported due to altercations with Protectrons, including five alleged shoplifters and one bystander. Holy crap, the felon's cashier disabled the Protectron's pending technology review. Holy crap. Merchants meeting cancel avoid further media scrutiny. Oops, 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 oops. I mean to go off there. Margarita party. It, uh, it's not all work around here because we are officially invited to the full on Fallon's margarita party. Despite rumors that we haven't hit our sales goals, I'm pleased to announce that we will still be holding our annual margarita party on October 1st. Time to let your hair down and really move the needle. We will also be holding our famous and occasionally dangerous mild salsa and hot guacamole contest. Each employee will have the opportunity to handcraft their own handmade salsa and guacamole and put it in uh, in it to a d uh, democratic vote. Take the lead and exploit your salsa's core competencies. If you are all interested in entering the competition, please let me know by September 24th. Alternatively, please let Sandy know because she needs something to do. Just kidding, Sandy. We all know how hard you are. Uh, how? Sorry. We all know you work hard and you are responsible for the the least twenty percent of our organic growth. Vivian, radiation suit delivery. Tammy received a delivery of two dozen radiation suits at the front desk, but the packaging was missing the labels. Should I assume this is a fallout shelter and not some new winter fashion line we're marketing? Also, can you send me, can you send one, someone down to move the six mattresses that were delivered into the shelters or into the shelter? The doctor advised that I shouldn't be lifting anything over 15 pounds since I am less than three months away from my due date. Thanks, Grace. October 23rd, bring the kids to work day. Happy Monday, everyone. Just a quick reminder that this Saturday, October 23rd, is our annual Bring Your Kid Kids to Work Day. As usually, as usual, we'll be holding an annual Halloween raffle and Hawaiian shirt contrast, contest contest ugh, in the afternoon. Continental breakfast will be served at 8 a.m. sharp. See you there. Candace, Candace uh, Perwatsky, Waltzitz. Remember that while this event is by no means mandatory, we highly encourage everyone's participation and look forward to seeing you all in your best Hawaiian shirts. PPS. I know some have expressed reservations about scheduling this event on a Saturday instead of a Friday, like usual, but think of how much more efficient we'll be doing will be during the regular work week without the distraction of the pesky kids running around. I did it again. I did it again. Sorry, guys. Um, Candace or Kaus Kowalski. Kowalski. <laughs> uh, yeah. Welcome, Grace um, Abernanthy. Ooh, Grace Abernanthy. Okay. Hello, everyone. Today will be Can uh, Candace per Perk Owitz. Perkowitz. Perkowitz. There we go. Perkowitz. Last day of employment at Fallon's HQ. We'd like to thank Candace for her many years of dedicated service and wish her the best in her future endeavors. Our CFO, Tracy Warwich, Warwick, will serve as an interim director of corporate tax until we find a permanent replacement for Candace. Thank you for Tracy. Thank you, Tracy, as always, for stepping up and keeping us dialed in. Uh, regards, best regards, Gary Fallon, CEO. Grace, please forward any tax correspondence to Tracy's office and any personal correspondence to Candace to pers uh, Parsons, CEO, uh, Jack Abbott. Oh, oh my God. 
Okay, it's happening. Everybody, got some news. Followed by... Yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes. Dave, calm, get down... Explosions. Down to the shelter right away? It's not a drill? Confirmation. What's happening? We seem to have lost contact with our affiliate stations. Oh, that is bad. We do, we do have... We do have coming in. That's, um... Oh, no. Confirmed reports, I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York. Oh, my God, it's happening. Pennsylvania. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my Oh, this is the recording of when it happened. I'm trying to read what some of this says. Blacks about communism? English coffee. Psycho tea? Possibly just the beverage. <laughs> Okay. What now? Gotta find the terminal. It... There's nothing else here. All right, I guess we just head out. No use. Jamie Z's corner inaccessible. Oh, right here. here's a terminal. Workshop etiquette. Not many br uh, bother reading the terminal in these dark times, but the event you are, come on in and appreciate your surroundings. Life out there is exhausting. A place like this can be, uh, can a place like this you can be yourself. I trust you're alone, and if you aren't, well, I can see you. But you won't be able to see me. I put some of my work on display. Please enjoy and make yourself at home. Provide, provide it you follow a few rules. Do not touch the fuse box. Oh god, I touched it. Unless you tend to disable the water and power. Oh crap. Um, we'll turn that back on. I've decided safeguards against interior decoration on the lower floors, unless you discover the secret to circumna uh, circumventation. Circumventation. Uh, leave your Brahmin outside unless you'd like their guts painted on the wall and your skeletons is played uh, with a Brahmin head fixed where the skull used to be. Well, um, think twice before heading upstairs to the top floor without an invitation. Thank you for reading. And if you are not, it doesn't matter anyway. You're here with me and we are uh, we have all the time in the world to get to know each other. Uh Fashion masks? For centuries, the hockey, hockey mask has been associated with homicide. Referred to as a security risk or a flag of, uh, of psychopath. Few remember why anymore, but I do. Back in those days that you were expected to smile at people who didn't care about you because it was polite. I like to think that we evolved. This path wasn't forced on me. The rotting skin, shot vocal cords, the ostracization, a reasonable trade-off for an extended lifespan. But only beneath the mask do I really get to live. Who in the heck? Uh, it isn't the same for all of us who wear the mask. The practice must be understood with within a particular social and cultural context. Some wear the mask to express their piety, their desire for increased mobility. Why mobility? In privacy in, si in social settings to hide an un unfortunate accident with a vial of acid or simply as a rejection of Western notion of sexuality. I find the mask to be a ideal means of avoiding small talk small talk without offending people is also it is also terribly comfortable really think uh to think everyone will be wearing them in the future ah huh. observation of film concierge after 
thousands of hours watching my 20th and 21st century horror film collection, I've concluded there are certain tropes that need to die. Let's split up. That way we no longer outnumber the threat we're dealing with. Yeah, that's true. Uh, running upstairs. Know your exits. When your mass killer is chasing you, heading out the front door to safety is always the prudent move. <laughs> Mirror scares. I wonder why they're showing us this scene of a protagonist opening a medicine cabinet. Yeah, always. Based on the true story, no, not really. Evil doll, like Chucky. Uh, there's a foot, they're a foot tall and lack basic motor skills. Evil children. Once you determine the kid is evil, explaining the to authorities how the pint-sized terror uh, perished by your hand is the only realistic challenge. Uh, celebrating too early. Always double tap. Always double tap. Uh, hitchhikers. Does that ever end well? No. Uh, dumb kids. Somehow they're all completely obvious and too obvious to obvious obviously too obvious danger until they I'm sorry oblivious oblivious to obvious danger until they become possessed or go missing yeah then they become smart right untimely sex when all your closest friends are dying around you why does that put you in the mood uh, useless pol uh, police officers thank god the police are here and he's dead the killer is in the back seat because of course he is all right let's open the door let's uh move carefully here wires terminal 